Good everyone, welcome to One Stop Academy. My name is Anthony Chinedu. Today I'm going to show you how to submit your assignments to your lecturers, how to take a quiz, and also how to join a faculty forum in case if you have any question for your lecturers or you want to interact with other students taking the same course. So the first thing from the university website, you click on online learning. When you click on online learning, you log in with your username and password. So type in your password. When you log in to your dashboard and you scroll down, you see all the courses, then you can enroll in a course. So for the purpose of this tutorial, I'm going to use GST 102, the use of English. So let me take this course. I'm already in this course as you can see these are the topics so introduction so at the end of this lesson now there's an assignment given and they say send assignment to cnk at goini.ego.ng this is the email address of the lecturer so if attached to any lesson or topic you will see the assignment at the end of the lesson and when you see the assignments at the end of the lesson, you will see the email address to send the assignment to. So if you're offering just 102, you will send the assignment to C and your care at goyuni.edu.ng. So when you're taking your courses, you check to know whether they send assignments given and if they send assignments the email address to submit the assignment to be given. To take an online quiz, I'm going to use GST 105 to demonstrate. So I'll click on take this course. And see from the course content, the first lesson is introduction. You can see we have three topics and one quiz. So we already know that there's a quiz at the end of this lesson. So I will expand. I will start with definition. And before you write the quiz, you must take the lessons first. The mark as complete. I'll scroll down. The mark as complete. complete and this is the quiz when I click on the quiz click on start the title of the quiz is just 105 so I'll click on start quiz and number one question is dash is an online file storage platform you have your options G drive next number two dash is the process of starting a computer or a computer embedded device okay let me choose um, the correct answer button then next NIC stands for let me choose the wrong answer now network image card you can go back to the previous question in case you are confused, you can choose the right one. Then you continue, click on next. Now I have answered all the questions. Click on finish quiz. Then the system will calculate your result for you. The quiz is complete. Results have been recorded. Now 
Now, the result is out. This is how to take an online quiz. So you can view the questions. See, number one. Got it correct. Number two. Got it correct. And number three, incorrect. So this is how to take an online quiz. To join a faculty forum, from the home page, you click on forums. When you get to the forum page, you choose your faculty. I will use faculty of natural sciences and environmental studies. When you click on it, we already have topics, we already have discussions going on. You can decide to comment in a topic. I'll just click on the first topic here is architecture classes. On it, it will show you the posts under architecture classes. So the first post is please, I don't see architectural classes 100 level second semester, please fix this. And someone replied, virus causes uploads are still being made. Please be patient. Then you can see another reply. All courses will be available before month end. So if I want to reply to this particular post, I will just type in the message here and click on notify me or follow up replies via mail and click on submit. But if you want to start a new topic, just go back, click on the faculty forum. When you scroll down, you type in the topic title, online registration. So I'll tick notify me and follow up replies via mail. So instead of checking the forum every day, I will just tick on this so that if there's any reply, then I'll get it in my mail automatically. That's the mail registered on our online learning platform. Then you click on submit. So as you can see, how do I register my courses? displaying on the forum so if there's any reply I will get it via my mail so this is how to join a faculty forum if you have any question you can use the comment box below to ask your questions and we're here to reply your questions if you're confused you can use the frequently asked question page to know whether your question uh, have already been answered thank you for watching this tutorial don't forget to comment share subscribe and like see you next time thank you